All right, we are now joined by pitcher Mary Half. Paul, you want to get us started? Absolutely. Mary, uh, first, congratulations on the win today. Um, can, can you just kind of talk to us about coming in in that sixth in that inning, you know, where they, they've got runners on and they've gotten within one run? Talk about that situation and, and your mindset going into there. Um, yeah, so obviously I was going in at, you know, a very critical moment with their best hitters coming up, Fale, and I have a lot of respect for her, so I'm like, okay, if I can get, you know, this girl out, I wasn't focused about the runners, you know, what the score was, I was like one batter at a time, and if I can get this girl, you know, the rest I felt pretty comfortable with, so getting her out was huge, and it being an infield fly where they couldn't um, advance the runners was huge. So, um, yeah, so whenever you go in, just throw strikes. And um, I was pretty confident with my defense behind me, but it really was just me focusing on one batter at a time and trying not to make the moment bigger than what it was. Uh, do you, is there any difference when you, when you start a game versus coming, coming in in a situation like that with runners on base? I mean, uh, I mean how is that different or do you just approach it the same way? Um, it's different because obviously when you start a game, you know, you kind of create your own destiny. You, you know, you come in with no runners on, um, you kind of got time to settle in and see where the umpire strike zone is. And whenever you come in for relief, you're like, okay, like throw strikes. Like you kind of rely on the pitcher before you to tell you really like what he's calling, what he's not, you know, you kind of got to pay attention and before you go in too to see where the umpire zone is. But I would say the most important thing is you have to throw strikes. And I think that's the difference between our pitching staff and theirs was that Coach Stifel instills in us, we have to throw strikes whenever, you know, like you come in for relief. So I think um, our whole pitching staff does a great job of doing that. And I really think that's what gives us that extra edge. How, how big a deal was it to, to kind of to kind of see your team just kind of be able to wipe out that that bad start in the first couple of innings and just keep fighting and, and, and clawing back. That just shows how much confidence we have in each other. Um, the bottom of our lineup was absolutely amazing today. Um, it wasn't our best, like you said, our first few innings, but um, our offense picked us up. And once we started getting some runs on the board, we're like, okay, like we're never out of a game. We've proved that time and time again. You know, you're going to have to wait until the last out of the seventh inning for us to officially lose a game. So um, we know to fight to the very last out. And it was so early in the game where like, there's so much game left. And, you know, we just had so much confidence in ourselves. And whenever the bottom of the lineup started producing, we're like, wow, like people are really stepping up today. So it was really cool to see. Absolutely. Did, uh, when did uh, when did coach let you know that you, uh, you, that you'd probably be coming in the game? I saw you warming up there, you know, fifth, pretty, fairly early. So was, was that the plan all along? Yeah, so that's been kind of like our rotation um, being kind of in that later relief. If the game's tied at the end, like, you know, you got to be ready. So that's kind of been me and Autumn's, you know, like roll, like if one's pitching the other, you know, is ready to come in at the end. It's such an offensive game nowadays. You, you to get a pitcher to go seven innings is crazy. So we know that we're going to, we may need some help on the back end. So it's just kind of like an unspoken rule, like, okay, like, be ready because you never know when you're going to have to go in. That's good. Right. I'm good. Somebody else right. have a question? Thank you. Anybody else have a question for Mary? All right, that will wrap us up. Thanks, everyone.